everyone, so for today's video I have got my everyday makeup routine. Okay, so to start off my everyday makeup look, I am going to be using the Maybelline New York Dream Fresh BB Cream in the shade Light. And then I will blend it in with the Rotenix Expert Facial Brush. If you're like wondering why I'm looking that way, it's because I've got a mirror this way. So, sorry if I keep looking there so I can actually see what I'm doing. Um, and yeah, so then I'll just like pat it in really gently. Um, let me go into concealer and I am in love with the Collection Lasting and Perfection Concealer. Um, I've always used the Rimmel Wake Me Up Concealer, um, but that ran out and then I was in Boots the other day and um, I heard a lot of people raving about this on like social media and stuff about how good it is and I thought I'd try it out. If you get the lightest shade it does act as a really nice highlight wherever you want to put it on. So I just put it under my eyes just to get rid of the dark circles. Um, and I do like an upside down triangle as I think I learned this on a beauty blog um, that this is the best way to get a really good coverage. And then I just pop it wherever I want to like cover up any blemishes. Sometimes I do use a beauty blender to blend that all in. Um, but recently I've been using the Rare Techniques Concealer Brush. Um, this is really, really good to be honest. It is quite small, so it does take a little while to like blend in all your concealer. And then I will just set all that in with the Fit Me Powder by Maybelline. Um, this is my first ever powder and I'm kind of like stuck with it. Um, but if you have any good recommendations on any other powder, make sure to leave them in the comments. I'm then going to go on to eyes, um, and I'll actually just prime my eyes with the Collection Lasting Infection Concealer. This is also really good because it also gets rid of any like veins like on my eyes. I just blend it in with my fingertips. Now I've kind of like primed my eyes. Um, recently I've been really loving the Bobbi Brown Greystone Eye Palette. Um, this is such a great palette if you really want a really nice smoky eye. So first of all I will go with the lighter shade which is this very very pale shade at the end. This is called Cream, it's just like a creamy white shadow. I will just use this Urban Decay brush which came with the Naked 3 palette. Just put that all over the lid. Okay once doing that I will then take this um, darker grey colour and I will just use this Real Techniques shading brush um, and I'll basically put it on the outer corner of my eye and slowly like blend it into my crease. Okay so once doing that I will then go in with the light shade again and I will just fill in my eyelid again just to really brighten it up. So basically trying to get the look of where it goes really really light to really really dark. Okay so I've done both eyes now and now I'm going to be going on to mascara and there's been two mascaras that I've been really really liking lately. It's the Smashbox Full Exposure Mascara um, and the Benefit Roller Lash. First of all, I will do a little bit of contour. I, I do the tiniest bit, um, and I've been loving the Benefit Hula Bronzer. Um, this is super, super pigmented. This is the mini size, if you can tell. Um, I got this in like a little Benefit gift set, um, and I love to apply it with the Real Techniques Rose Gold 301 Flat Contour Brush. Um, amazing brush to apply contour. Um, I like it because it really sits in your cheekbones um, and where you want to contour really, really well. For highlighter, I have to say this is probably my favourite one and it is Benefit High Beam. Um, so I'll apply this on my cheekbones, my cupid's bow, the tip of my nose and my brow bone. Um, just to have that highlight on fleek. <laughs> For blush, um, I have 
been going back to my old Benefit Rockator blush. So it's super, super natural. It's, it's really good when you've got a lot going on on the eyes and you only want like a little bit of like color in your cheeks. This is like the perfect blush for that. So I'm just applying that with the Real Techniques blush brush. And then I just do my brows with the Maybelline Brow Drama. This is just a transparent one. So to end off my everyday makeup routine, I will then go on to lips and recently I have been obsessing over the MAC Velvet Teddy Lipstick. I really think it suits the whole look in general and it just kind of like pulls it all together. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed this. If you want to see more um, everyday makeup looks in the future, like updated ones, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Also, make sure to go check out Chloe's channel. Um, like I said, it'll be linked in the description. Subscribe. And yeah, and I will just see you in my next video.